Hello family, this is your girl Portia. To my subbies, welcome back. Um, if you are watching this video for the first time, this channel is about home decor on a budget. So please, you know what to do. Press the notification button, subscribe if you are interested and your girl will hook you up. So on today's video, I'm reupholstering an old ottoman. So I thought instead of just checking it away, why don't I reuposter it? Give it some new life, upcycle it. So that is what I did. Went to a fabric store, got some material. So let's get to the video. Hope you enjoy. Hey, beautiful family. So on today's video, I'm going to show you how I did this beautiful um, faux shaper um, ottoman. So what we're going to need is a hot glue gun, contact, contact adhesive, some foam. This I, I got from an old mattress that I used for my baby's cot. So we're going to put the hot glue gun on the, on the ottoman and then put um, the adhesive just for strong hold. We're going to put both the hot glue gun and then we're going to put the adhesive and then we're going to press on the, the foam. I sat on the chair for a couple of minutes so that it can just um, hold. Then I began to cover the ottoman with bedding, two layers of bedding on all sides. And I used um, a staple gun to, to fasten the bedding. And this is how it should look. So I then um, took the material. I cut it into size. The top part is 16 by 16. The sides are 18 by 18 centimeters. I took all the, how many pieces? All the five pieces. I joined them together um, on the sewing machine. By the way, guys, did you know that I can sew? I'm trying, I'm self-taught. So I, I, I joined them all together. And voila, took it to the ottoman that is covered with bedding. I dressed it up, tried to put it nicely, every corner on the corners, pulled it down a bit. Um, by the way, this material is stretchy, so I don't want to overstretch it as well. So I just pulled it um, nicely to cover the ottoman on all sides. Then I took the, I flipped it upside down, took my staple gun, and then I just stapled everything together. All the sides, I stapled them together, and that was it. That was the finished product. We are done with our ottoman. And how quick was that, guys? So you see? If you have any old ottomans that you have, you don't need to throw them away. Just look for your upholstery favorite fabric. There's so much on at the um, fabric stores, so much to choose from. I'm sure when you get there, you'll even be confused on what to choose. You choose that, you get your bedding. You get um, foam if yours still needs um, a bit of foam for comfort. And in less than in less than what? two hours, if you're not lazy like me, you should be done. Because there's not much to it. When you put the, the foam with the glue and you cut your fabric, you sew. Sewing, especially if you don't have like hard material like leather or faux leather, if it's like material like the one that I chose, um, that should not take you long. Think at most, what, 30 minutes at most. Yeah. And then you just cover it, you put your, you cover it, you staple it with your staple gun and that's it. You will have yourself a brand new ottoman. So I hope this video will motivate you also to think about reupholstering. Um, it's not a difficult job that we think it's for the mighty men. No, we can also do it. So this was definitely a home decor on a budget. All in all, I think I just spent um, 50 rands on the material. I hope you have enjoyed the video, guys. 
so this is the point where i beg <laughs> guys so please don't forget to share to comment um to subscribe hit the notification button so that every time i load a video you shall be notified um so the next one will be next week see you then guys keep well i love you all